critics said it could not be done. Captive bred lions are not suitable for reintroduction programs. Animals being kept in captivity cannot be used in relocation programs. Animals in captive breeding facilities cannot be released back into the wild. Leo is a leo. He is an opportunist. That is in his genes, that is in his system and gebouw. He will you. To the contrary, the South African Predator Association and its members believe the opposite. And we aim to prove it. Sapa, in collaboration with Sapa members Tini Bumberger, Nico Briet, and other friends of the association, are currently implementing an exciting and groundbreaking project, relocating captive bred lions into free roaming areas on nature reserves in the Limpopo province. In the first instance, a male and female lion donated by Tini were selected for relocation. While in the second instance, a male lion, again donated by Tini, and four lionesses donated by Nico were made available for release. In both these cases, relocating the lions towards the end of 2016 involved careful planning and execution, backed by an extensive paper trail of regulatory requirements. Before loading the lions into transport containers, they were pre-treated with antibiotics and multivitamins, vaccinated against possible disease, while other precautionary measures were also taken to ensure their optimal well-being during and after relocation. DNA samples were collected to record and document their genetic integrity. Another breakthrough for the South African Predators Association as we all know, South Africa is the only country that's lion population grew with an estimate of 17% over the past 10 years. All other African countries had a, had a decline in their lion population. So this is a very proud moment for us as uh, the South African Predators Association to relocate five of our lions that's been DNA, DNA profiled and ready to get relocated into previously cattle ranches that will also create habitat. The first pair of lions was initially confined to a 50 hectare camp for quarantine purposes and to adapt to their new environment. Eventually, the pair was released into the larger nature reserve, comprising of 5,000 hectares. The ultimate goal is to have an established pride of self-reliant lions on this large tract of land. In December 2016, after being kept in a boma for a week, the second pride, consisting of the male and four female lions, were released in a 1,300 hectare area. They were released into the larger reserve, having 25,000 hectares of natural habitat at their disposal. Any successful relocation program would have to prove that captive bred lions released into a free roaming and wild environment were able to fend for themselves and breed successfully. Critics argue that captive bred lions will not survive in a natural environment because they are too domesticated and never learn to hunt for their food. In both cases, these myths were quickly dispelled. And they have as a group of them together? Yes, they have together. Different species that they have together? Yes, they have together. Yes, they have together. Yes, they have together. Yes, Zebra, lovely bees. A verschillenheid van species. Ja. Is het zo gelijk of wel een stukje dat om te vangen? Of is het een makkelijk aan te vangen? Nee. Dus je ziet de eerste wijze waar de eerste aand uit gaat gaan. Voor die zon of als die volgende nog een duit zijn bij haar eier, dan groeit het goed op. Ik vind dit dit lijkt niet of wel of wel iets ook je ik kom in niks weet. Wel weet je maar dat je af te verschillen. In 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 natuurlijke gedrag, je tellen je tellen beginnen sociale gedrag wijs waar dominante wijsie voorloop en daar. Dat was ook nu nog wel bij interessant want want die vier wijfies was nog maar altijd alleen nog in de let niet erg. Maar toen die mannetje betrokken raak in toe toe beginnen ons nu zien die rangorde van die wijfies. The well-being and progress of the released lions is closely monitored and well documented. At this stage, all indications are that they adapted well to their new environments. This is a groundbreaking uh, um, event and we do trust that uh, by this uh, action, uh, the 
the, the, the misconception that uh, captive bread line can never be uh, uh, taken back into the wild will be changed. Uh, once a, an animal, you remain an animal, the animal keeps all its instinct. And with time, uh, history will be changed and be made. It is envisioned that this preliminary study will be backed by more extensive and scientific research on the release of captive bred lions into the wild. We at Saba believe a lion remains a lion, be that born in captivity or in the wild.